Hey everybody, Friendly Greens here, and first off, I just want to say thank you everybody to the new subscribers that are joining in, I appreciate you all so much, but today's topic is going to be about, is Royal Queen Seeds any good? So, number one, I think that their freebie system is pretty good for most of what they offer. You get points with every purchase that you can use then to redeem on other purchases for like a little bit of cents off and here and there. I mean if you save some up then you can get a decent bit off but it's not too bad. Not too bad. So it's definitely nice. And number two I think the plants are pretty good. Good genetics. Uh, you, no problems with uh, germination so far besides like beginner errors and stuff like sopping wet frickin paper towels when I put it in a ziploc bag murdering them like that you know beginner errors like that but after I dialed it in you know it, I've been having really good germination rates with them and every plant that I've grown from them so far is just amazing that it grows quick I mean I have a northern lights in there right now and she's I think two weeks from sprout I think I'm not too sure I mean she's about yay big and yay big around I mean she's doing it she's doing it pretty good number three the shipping is like whew, it's the fastest out of like all the places that I've ordered from so far which would be uh, Mephesto, I ordered from there, um, and then Barney's Farms, so, not too, too many places, but Royal Queen Seeds is definitely the fastest out of them, uh, very discreet packaging as well, which is quite nice, everybody loves that, you know, you don't want big open lettering on your boxes saying, hey, I'm growing here, even though if you're in a legal state or not, I mean, still don't really want people knowing that you're growing I mean besides close family members I mean even if them at that so keep that in mind too when ordering from them number four it's got a good selection for beginners I think personally as a beginner myself they have quick one which is for beginners I grew that I got two and a half ounces and a little bit of shake and whatnot and measure or weigh out the shake I didn't really care for that but it was pretty good grew really nice the whole time I didn't have any complications at all the whole time through so very perfect very nice Moi. loved it loved it a lot and then they also have like good seeds for like intermediate growers as well I feel like I'm, there's a few that are and I'm wanting to try after this grow here. I'm thinking about doing some watermelon autos. So stay tuned for that. I'm really hoping to get those girls popped and germinated. And you know, number five, they have very good customer service, in my opinion, anyway. Uh, they respond really quickly. If you have any issues with like seeds not germinating, you can like message them and they'll more than happily send you a new seed they're not gonna be quick to blame you as a grower and say oh you did this wrong and that wrong and what not like some other companies do I'm not saying that I've had that happen to me but I've heard horror stories of that happening so kinda avoid some of that stuff and you know kind of about it on my review over them so far and I would say yeah they're good they're a good company I like them a lot uh, definitely give them a try if you're thinking about it and if you're still on the fence and are wanting to see any certain strains from there definitely browse their catalog and drop a comment down below and be like hey I kind of want to see this strain try this and maybe I'll do that on the next run after these gals are done so not too much longer on them either and I definitely definitely really appreciate all of the new subscribers y'all know who you are and I appreciate
appreciate all of you guys who have been sticking with the channel from the beginning as well. Thank you all so much. I appreciate you all so, so much. And that's about it. Later, fam.